Hi there. In this video, I am going to show my first web application that I have built. I should say this is a small application, but I think it is good enough application for beginner level. And the programming languages that I have used for this application were HTML, CSS and JavaScript for frontend and Python and Django for backend. And this is the final look of this application. This is basically a block type application in which you can write posts and read some posts. And you can you can do a lot of filters here and let me show those filters. And you can search the posts here and let me type something. Okay, if I search based on Python, you can see it shows there are four posts based on Python and there are zero authors with name related to python and also you can filter down these posts by most likes and you can see the post with most likes were sorted in the descending order and also you can filter these posts by recency as well that is based on the date and the time at which the post is posted and also you can filter down these posts by tags as well if I click on this tag, it shows the post related to this tag. And also you can combine this filter with another tag as well. And you can see this combined result of these tags is also shown here. And you can click on any of these posts and it will show the content of this post. And you can see this is the post of this. This is the content of this post and this is the author. You can like this post and also comments and write some comments as well. And if if you you can comment like and sorry you can comment and like only if you have logged in. So let me let me log in here. So let's log in here, and I have already account. Uh, let me type those credentials as of now. Mm. And this shows I have successfully logged in, and here you can see my stats as well my my name and posts and likes that i that i have got for my posts and and i can you can also see i can write new post and i can see my profile here you can see my profile my personal data and i can edit i can even edit my profile as well my i can change my profile picture and and i can see my posts till now i have wrote, till now I wrote two posts and you can see my posts under my profile as well and now let me register with you so new let's account. log out here and register for new account okay let me register for new account let me say just youtube and uh, let me type some dummy password uh, email as well and the dummy password and confirmation of the password for more security and you can see my account has created successfully let me log in with that account uh, you can see my account is uh, is logged in with the name youtube and the post zero that means i haven't posted any post yet this is the new account that's what shows here and uh, let me write new post right over here and uh, let me let me type something steve's style test amazon prime that's it and uh, let me upload some thumbnail for this post and uh, let me write something and steve's That's man of all time. Yes, man. In cricket, I know he's bad. Team style. By okay, just like that. And I can select the tags related to this post. And this is you cannot edit the tags further. That's why I have, you have to be careful that over here. And then let me select this sports and the general as well and let me post this post 
and you can see this is the look of my post which shows the thumbnail and the content of this post and you can now i can write some comment right over here just this is cool thumbnail and you can see my comment here and i can log in i can like this comment as well and can see the like count is also updating now let me see whether the tag tag count is updated or not let me go to the home and you can see before i used to have one post related to sports now i have two posts let me click on these two posts and you can see the post which we have just written is also showing here that's good and also i have another post on this that is also showing as well and, and now I, I want to log, log out log out from the application and let me show the brief view of this application and this is the final look and this uh, and this is what this interface look like and uh, and if you want the source code of this application I will comment on I will give you the link to this source code of this application in the description below and that's it for this video thank you very much for watching please subscribe